Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to shred chicken breast. Now, I like to use poached chicken because the meat is more tender, but also because there's usually less seasoning, so I can use this shredded chicken for a lot of recipes. So the first method, obviously, is if you have chicken breasts that are cold, you can just shred it with your hands. The other, if it's still hot, you're going to want to use two forks to do the job. So with two forks, with your fingers pointing like this, you're going to want to separate the chicken meat. Now you're going to want to shred your chicken either after you cook it and it's cooled down to touch or you know once it's at room temperature. When you refrigerate it, shredding chicken is really a lot tougher. Um, so I like to, if you're going to need shredded chicken for your recipes, it's best to shred your chicken before you store it. All right, so the other method, if you just don't want to use the forks, is to use a hand mixer. So you're gonna wanna use a deep bowl or something where your chicken's not gonna go all over the place. It, you also can use a stand mixer if you have that, but you're gonna want to use the mixing paddles for this. What? I'm, I'm totally impressed. I was, I was like, oh, this is totally out of work. Out of your I was like, this isn't going to work. I only use this for cookie dough. <laughs> Could it actually be like perfect? Yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah. We're laughing because we're really impressed. This actually really worked. So I think the hand mixer method is great if you're going to shred if you're gonna meal prep and shred a lot of chicken, this is definitely the way to go. Way better than the um, fork method. So let's put that side by side. So the hand mixer method is finer in texture. So this is really a great method if you want um, like less defined chicken pieces. I think I would actually prefer this myself. And then with two forks, um, it's nearly impossible to get a um, very sh fine shred like that. So you do get some larger pieces um, just the same way as you would with your hands. And now, of course, for more chicken recipes, check the links below the video and how to cook chicken three different ways. This is the channel for chicken because it is the protein my family completely loves. See you next time.